John Vibes is here to entertain you. In life, whenever you want to venture into a particular sector of the activities in the economy, make sure you're giving your best. Make sure you follow the rules and regulations binding the activities and make sure you don't create all sort of allegations and controversies around you. This is definitely not the case of Kelly Kumalo because of recent, many people are actually wanting her to even pass on already because she's actually not doing the right thing as far as gospel music is concerned. Many people keep complaining of the fact that she expects poses her body a lot already and I'm about to give you some very shocking details because of this broke Kelly Kumalo down completely and definitely I'm very sure she should be in tears right now. I'm about to give you some very shocking reasons why people don't want to see Kelly Kumalo on stage perform no more especially gospel music so make sure you watch this video right up to the end. Before I give you the entire details you are welcome to my YouTube channel. Do well to subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment up after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell so that you will always be updated whenever I drop my videos. Haters just can't stop harassing Kelly Kumalo already. Social media users were left so upset when she recently posted a video of herself singing her gospel song and she was wearing just a bodysuit. The video shared on Facebook and Twitter angered many Christians who said she was dressed inappropriately for someone singing a gospel song. In 2020, she also caused a lot of controversy by singing gospel in a skimpy outfit. Twitter user Bishop Gesh said Kelly had defiled the gospel industry. The user wrote and I quote, I cannot talk about church because Kelly denounced Christianity openly sometime last year. Why did she do it anyways? Another user, Wonderful Kumalo, wrote, and I quote, What impression did she intend to make? Is this the no gospel? Facebook user Trevor Kiliza wrote, and I quote, She never got deliverance from the power of Satan. She is lost. May God have mercy on her. She is so disgraceful. Christian activist Solomon Ashams also commented, saying, Kelly's clothing was so distasteful. He actually said, and I quote, I am not addressing her as a gospel singer, which she isn't, although that actually brought her fame when she started. I am addressing her because she professed to be a Christian. Musicians like Kelly, although vocally gifted, must stay far away from singing gospel. The gospel is about talking the talk and walking the walk, he said. Guys, when asked for comments, Kelly Kumalo replied him and said, Prepare enough space in your paper because next time I will be literally going naked, singing the same song. Guys, I'm going to actually do a lot of things, Daily Sun reported. Why would Kelly Kumalo decide to be venturing in such activities is what I keep asking myself. Of course, she is known to be singing some gospel songs, but people are definitely refusing the fact that she is a gospel artist because of her outfit. Last time, she deliberately, I mean, almost went, like, I mean, with no clothes on on the street, and a lot of cameras, paparazzi actually got her, and the picture trended on social media. Imagine that this was a gospel artist of your church. How were you supposed to take this? How will your church take this? And how? Would, what would people think about your church? Are people actually wanting to get sanctified no more from your church things are getting so sad and breaking already but i really hope and wish that kelly kumalo listens to the crowd of people and definitely she adjusts already because she's going out of hand but in as much i still love kelly kumalo very much i love her vocal ability i love everything about her tell me in the comment section what you feel and do well to subscribe and hit on to my past notification bell i love you from the bottom of my heart